Is your hair an unruly mess? It's recording? Yeah. Hello and welcome to my channel. This is my second video and <laughs> oh my god. Today I'm going to show you how I actually style my curly hair. <laughs> if you're interested in seeing how I got this look, please stay for the rest of this video. So this is what my hair looks like after not having washed it for a week. As you can see, the curls just kind of clump together and my hair doesn't have that much volume. As for products, I use the Shea Moisture Hair Care line, but something I think makes all the difference is using my own apple cider vinegar rinse right after I shampoo. And then I follow up with this conditioner. My absolute favorite product is the Kinky Curly Not Today Leave-In Detangler. I will link all of these products down below. I like to apply my leave-in conditioner and detangler as soon as I get out of the shower. So I'm just gonna separate my hair into two sections and apply this all over my hair. This product is all natural and so is the Shea Moisture Hair Care line. I think it's super important to use natural products, especially for curly hair, sulfate, Free shampoos are highly, highly recommended. <laughs> I'm making that face because this leave-in conditioner feels and smells amazing. It really, really works. Once I'm done putting that through my hair with my fingers, I like to use a wide tooth comb. Always start from your ends and then work your way up. Using a wide tooth comb just keeps your curls from separating too much and it also just helps keep the natural shape of your curls. My hair is pretty long but I don't like to use that much product as you can see. And using a wide tooth comb just really distributes the product throughout your hair. I like to detangle my hair when it's wet and after I've put my detangler slash leave-in conditioner in it because it just makes the whole process a lot easier and a lot smoother. You can definitely detangle your hair when it's dry. I would just say to put some sort of oil in it to make it slippery and easier too. Using this large cotton Heisenberg shirt, I'm going to squeeze the excess water out of my hair. I don't like using a towel just because it's a little harsh and t-shirts work just as well at absorbing the excess water. I also put my hair in this little turban looking thing and if you're like, how the heck do I do that, I will link a video down below. But I usually leave this overnight, take it out, then voila! That was it for my curly hair video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please comment, like, or subscribe. Thank you.